A young rapper is missing tonight, gone almost a week. His family frantic. They have no clue where he is. Just a wild thought. Did his music make him a target? Fox Our Jeremy, Jeremy Ross. Sorry. Here with the story, Jeremy. Chris, tell us. Yvonne Young was driven home after work by his boss last Tuesday evening. He was dropped off around 10:15. About 30 minutes later, he vanished, and the search for answers began. Something is wrong. A man who called this place home hasn't been there for about a week. Near the intersection of 52nd and Custer, his image rests on trees. We did the flyers. We went door to door. 22-year-old Yvonne Young disappeared January 1st. My fear is that the following day, he was supposed to see his mother. <laughs> but Annette Perry says her son never made the visit. Hope and at times terrible thoughts stopped by instead. My fear is that my baby won't come home. Perry says she called her son last Tuesday night around 10:30. The last words spoken to him were, "I love you." Young's roommate heard a car pull up outside their home and saw Young leave around 10:45. The 22-year-old left his jacket behind, suggesting he wouldn't be gone long. He hasn't shown up for work. No one has been able to reach him since. So I started calling back and calling back, and it was going straight to voicemail. Online, Young is easy to find. On YouTube, the rapper goes by the name Young LT. His mother says he's never run away before and has no known enemies, though his music could draw scorn or jealousy from others. He's an up-and-coming artist, so there's always people that talk mess here and there. But the family is hoping someone is interested in talking about where Young is, offering this plea. Please call me. Please call the police station. The numbers are on the flyers. Hit us on Facebook. We've got all type of ways for them to contact us. We have links to all the contact information the family was talking about on our website. That's fox6now.com. A vigil is scheduled to take place tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the area of 52nd and Custer. Live in the newsroom, Jeremy Ross, Fox 6 News. Hopefully someone will answer her plea tonight. Thank you, Jeremy, for that. Kenosha police, meanwhile, are looking for a missing woman. 19-year-old Christina Gill was last seen at a home in Kenosha on December 29th. She was wearing gray sweatpants and a black jacket. Her family members say she has a noticeable limp in her right leg. If you know anything, if you think you've seen her, call Kenosha Police at that number. Meanwhile, no sign of Nick Wilcox. He was last seen about 2 in the morning on New Year's Day at the Irish Rec Room downtown in Milwaukee. Family and friends have been searching ever since. MPD's dive team was on the river tonight, but they say they found nothing belonging to him. For the latest on these three searches we just told you about, tune in to Fox 6 Wake Up. They start at 4.30 in the morning tomorrow. No job, no answers. That